So the sum goes on like this. Narendra Dubey of Pune sent 1000 units of stainless steel vessels to Uma Shankar of Hyderabad to be sold on consignment basis. The terms were that Uma Shankar would get a 5% plus 2% delegated commission and reimburse for expenses incurred. The cost of Narendra Dubey was 50 per unit. So per unit was how much? 50 rupees it seems. He incurred 500 as a packing and forward charges. On receipt of consignment, Uma Shankar accepted a bill, accepted a bill. He's not paying a cash. He's accepting a bill of 25,000 payable after three months. Uma Shankar also paid 1,200 as a freight and cartage and 800 as a rent. So Uma Shankar is a consignee and Dubey is a consigner on Mata. So here, what is he doing, ma'am? Recurring and non recurring both are there so that we have to identify. Next, Uma Shankar sold 900 units at 880 per unit. One quarter of her sales were on a credit. One customer failed to pay the amount 2000 due from him. Uma Shankar remitted necessary amount to Narendra Dubey, gave the necessary ledger accounts in the books of both the parties, he said. So he's asking in both the parties. Ma. So here, so first I'm going to go with doing in the books of Narendra Dubey, that is consigner. So what I will do first, we'll go for writing what all information he has given so that it becomes very easy for us to record the information. So first, the goods which were sent on a consignment. So goods, goods sent on consignment, where how many units ma? So 1000 units at the rate of 50 rupees center. So it will be how much goods sent on consignment? 50,000. Then consigner expenses. So consigner expenses, uh, what I'll do, I'll write his name. N Dubey and Rasanan. So he is consigner. So consigner, all expenses we are going to treat as what? Non-recurring. So how much he is paying expenses? Uh, he has paid 500 HM. So what for anedi manakausaram ledu? Because his expenses will be taken as important for all the things. So next is Uma Shankar. Uma Shankar is a consignee. So Uma Shankar's expenses, cons, total expenses are, so what I'll do in this one, non-recurring NR I'm going to take. So non-recurring is what? 1200 because freight and cartage means only once he will pay no. So that is what. And then recurring is 800. Rent and every month. Kada. So total amount of consignee OCSE. Eight, sorry, 2,000. 2,000 are his expenses. So this is one information. And then what he said, uh, then what he said is, uh, yeah. Uma Shankar, accepted bill of 25,000. So what this is called advance. So this is one more information. And uh, what is the next one? Yeah, commission. So commission is five plus Seven percent total ga adi yella ochin ante five plus two percentage kalipute ochin dan mata. So it is it is a combination of what del grade commission. So on sales obviously apre na sare on sales se tis kundam invoice unna apre den mida ane di we have to be careful or else simply will take on the sales an mata. This is one more information. Yeah, then actual. Sales done by Uma Shankar are how much? 900 at the rate of 
ఎయిటీ ఎయిట్ సెమ్స్ అంటే ఎంత సెవెంటీ టూ అంతే కదా నైన్ ఎయిట్ సో సెవెంటీ టూ థౌజండ్ సో దిస్ ఈజ్ ద అవైలబుల్ ఇన్ఫర్మేషన్ మనం ఏవేవైతే ఇచ్చాడో కంపల్సరీ వీ హ్యావ్ టు టేక్ ఇట్ నా వన్ ఇన్ఫర్మేషన్ ఐఎమ్ స్కిప్పింగ్ అవుట్ వన్ ఇన్ఫర్మేషన్ ఐఎమ్ స్కిప్పింగ్ అవుట్ వాట్ ఈస్ దట్ ఇన్ఫర్మేషన్ ఐఎమ్ స్కిప్పింగ్ అవుట్ ఈస్ వన్ క్వార్టర్ ఆఫ్ ద సేల్స్ వేర్ ఆన్ అ క్రెడిట్ అండ్ కస్టమర్ కుడ్ నాట్ ఏబుల్ టు పే టూ థౌజండ్ అని అన్నాడు ఐ యామ్ లీస్ట్ బాదర్డ్ ఇఫ్ వీ ఆర్ పేయింగ్ అ డెల్ గ్రేట్ కమిషన్ ఐ యామ్ లీస్ట్ బాదర్డ్ అబౌట్ దిస్ వన్ but if we are not paying a del grade commission if we are not paying del grade commission then in such case i will take as a on the debit side nana consignment lo debit side as a bad debt ani raskunta but akkada kaakapothe simple ga i am least bothered so that is the reason i am not even taking that one so shall we start with the posting so as i already have told you we will the consignment mainly ledger postings is going to us so what all will be included in this one just keep in a mind so first and foremost consignment account is just like a replica of your trading or pnl account something like that only so that's why ఆల్మోస్ట్ హూ ఈస్ ఇంట్రెస్టెడ్ టు నో అబౌట్ అ ప్రాఫిట్ కన్సైన్మెంట్ ద్వారా వచ్చినది ప్రాఫిట్ ఆ లాస్ అని తెలుసుకోవడానికి ఎవరు ఇంట్రెస్టెడ్ ఉంటారు ఓన్లీ ద ఓనర్ విల్ బీ ద ఇంట్రెస్టెడ్ పర్సన్ సో దట్ ఈస్ ద రీజన్ ఆల్వేస్ ద ట్రాన్సాక్షన్స్ ఆర్ రికార్డెడ్ ఇన్ ద కన్జైనర్ అనమాట కన్జైనర్ బుక్స్ కన్జైనీ బుక్స్ లో ఏమీ అవసరం లేదు వాడికి ఏమి అవసరం లేదు వాడికి కమిషన్ వచ్చిందా లేదా అనేది ఇంపార్టెంట్ వాడికి సో దట్ ఈస్ ద రీజన్ నంబర్ ఆఫ్ బుక్స్ యూ విల్ ఫైండ్ ఓన్లీ ఇన్ ద బుక్స్ ఆఫ్ కన్జైనర్ సో ఫస్ట్ ఈస్ particulars amount particulars amount so here i am going to write as consignment account in the books of n dubey means consigner so first what all we are going to have it so i said nen already starting consignment gunchi cheppetappude cheppan chaala simple nana just you are going to keep in a mind that it is like a trading account so first you are going to have always information about stock so kabatti ikkada we are going to call goods sent on consignment so goods sent on consignment enta we have got 1000 at the rate of 50 so that will be how much 50000 then ever the expenses this call is the first first foremost consignor expenses kada so vaadi expenses vaadi books lo mana vaadi peru teesukovadu kabatti two bank expenses ani rasi we are going to show as a 500 then after consignor expenses next comes consignee expenses so appudu uma shankar we are going to call and expenses so athani expenses aithe mana raiskochu kada ikkada total of expenses raayalana only calculation of unsold abnormal losses cases maatrame you are going to take it separately i'm not telling abnormal losses if time is permitting i'll tell you the points you should remember in the abnormal cases abnormal losses because as per my knowledge abnormal problem we would examination so waste of like you just refer the notes whatever we have prepared but do not just spend the maximum time do not go for uh, putting your head in that but now this is done now next comes is uma shankar commission we have paid even commission to him so adi manaku telid kada enta vade em annadu 7% on sales so sales paina enta nana sales i have calculated how much పైన మనకు సేల్స్ అది కూడా నేను చెప్పేశాను నేను సేల్స్ ఎంత అని సో ఇట్ ఈస్ సెవెంటీ టూ థౌజండ్ ఇంటూ సెవెన్ పర్సెంట్ సో హౌ మచ్ యూఆర్ గోయింగ్ టు గెట్ ఇట్ మీరు ఏం చేయరు కదా నేనే చేసుకోవాలి సో ఫైవ్ జీరో ఫోర్ జీరో అనమాట ఇంత వచ్చింది నా దీస్ ఆల్ ద థింగ్స్ ఆర్ డన్ నా వీ హ్యావ్ టు రైట్ అ సేల్స్ ఆల్సో నో ఆన్ ద ఆపోజిట్ సైడ్ సో హియర్ హూ ఈస్ మేకింగ్ సేల్స్ నేనైతే చేయట్లేదు సో నా బదులుగా ఎవరు చేస్తున్నారు ఉమా శంకర్ సో కాబట్టి అగైన్ హియర్ వీఆర్ గోయింగ్ టు రైట్ హిజ్ నేమ్ ఓన్లీ యాజ్ సేల్స్ సో హౌ మచ్ సెవెంటీ టూ థౌజండ్ ఇది నేను డీటెయిల్స్ రాస్తున్నాను ఎన్ని రే చేశాడు మా నైన్ హండ్రెడ్ 
at the rate of 80 per unit chaser. So, this is the chaser. Now, I always say that I have to 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 1000 units. And I have to say that I have to say that both debit and credit should match. But here, what is happening? Debit, you have 1000 units, whereas credit, you had only 900 units. So, that means 100 still are left over. So, when 100 are left over, and that we call it as what? We call it as buy unsold stock leda consignment stock we are going to call it so what we are going to call it is unsold stock or consignment stock so 100 units are left over now shall i do calculation part here only i'll do calculation part here only nana so what i'll do is first Hundred units at the rate of cost price and the obviously fifty rupees. So, I am going to get at a thousand five thousand rupees. Then, din ki mane wever expenses add just tamu we are going to add. Consign. Ama. Uh, consigner expense. Uh, consigner and all the expenses will be consigner will be all the expenses will be called as a non-recurring. So nini ka debit side chuda na consigner when expenses rasa nu five hundred. So mano yeh chesta mo mottam ibe ni units ki only fifty ka. Uh, sorry hundred units ka kado mottam thousand units. So for thousand, if the expenses are 500 I think I want for how many hundred units key how much so, no, multiplication so how much it is going to be 50 okay so 50 then you could in our expenses at chest amu we are going to add consignee expenses so consignee expenses uh, how much my 2000 in debit lo rasindi 2000 but consignee the matram we have to be very particular how much is a recurring how much is a non recurring so that is a reason we are going to see in the textbook so he says that 1200 is a freight and cartage 800 is a rent so that means rent is a recurring all the time but freight and cartage only clearing charges there so that's why only 1200 i'm going to take so what is that concept again for a thousand if the expenses are 1200 then i want for 100 it's how much 120 120 120 okay so 120 is this one. So total is how much now? 5,170. So this is my unsold stock. I'm done with this one. So that's it. So now I'll just cross check. Do I think anything I have missed out? So if I see 1,000 units and on the credit side, I'll just match up. So 900 plus 100 units of unsold stock. So everything is done perfectly. So we are going to close it. Nothing else is there. So I'm going to close it. So when I'm closing it, please tell me how much you are getting it. Obviously, you will have a debit credit side more. You will have a profit only. So just tell me how much is the profit. Uh, 77,170. Uh, credit side. Man. Okay. 77,170. Yeah. Okay. Nineteen thousand six thirty, man. Nineteen thousand six thirty. Okay, one second, one second. Idi total and seventy seven. Ah, this Idi total. Ah, credit side. Iga both the sides ante osa gadra. Idi iko total. Ah, ona. Hmm. Idi ikara profit ekada ochi ne. Indhikante ikar fifty ya ondi. Anta kana pe. So profits, consignment profit, mali ekri ke transfer chestamu. P and L ke transfer chestam. Gurto petko na na owner profit obviously will be transferred to the P and L only. So this is done. So how much you said Satish? Nineteen thousand three sixty ya. Six thirty. Okay. So this is done. Now, 
ఈ కన్సైన్మెంట్ ఒక్కటే ప్రతిసారి క్లాస్ లో చెప్తూనే ఉన్నాను మళ్ళీ చెప్తున్నాను కన్సైన్మెంట్ ఒక్కటే మనం జాగ్రత్తగా ప్రిపేర్ చేసుకోవాలి నాన్న మిగతావన్నీ డ్యామ్ ఈజీ యూ గోయింగ్ టు హ్యావ్ ఇట్ బికాస్ జస్ట్ కన్సైన్మెంట్ ఇఫ్ యూ పోస్ట్ ద థింగ్స్ ప్రాపర్లీ ద రెస్ట్ ఆల్ విల్ బి జస్ట్ ఆపోజిట్ పోస్టింగ్స్ యూఆర్ గోయింగ్ టు మేక్ నథింగ్ ఎల్స్ now in the books of narendra dubey we are supposed to prepare whose account we will prepare the opposite person so who is opposite person uma shankar account so uma shankar is our kanzaini uma shankar is our kanzaini account so idi ela prepare chestam so remember ma ఎవ్రీథింగ్ యు ఆర్ గోయింగ్ టు హ్యావ్ ఉమా శంకర్ ఓన్లీ కన్సైన్మెంట్ లో కనిపిస్తాడు ఒక్క ఎంట్రీ తప్ప వాట్ ఈస్ దట్ ఎంట్రీ ఈస్ అడ్వాన్స్ ఐ ఆల్వేస్ హ్యావ్ టోల్ వన్స్ అగైన్ ఐఎమ్ టెలింగ్ కన్జైనీ అకౌంట్ జస్ట్ కన్సైన్మెంట్ యూ ప్రిపేర్ ప్రాపర్లీ జస్ట్ బి కేర్ఫుల్ పుట్ అటెన్షన్ ఇన్ ప్రిపేరింగ్ ద కన్సైన్మెంట్ అకౌంట్ రెస్ట్ ఆల్ జస్ట్ ఆపోజిట్ పోస్టింగ్స్ just you are, you will not have what we say advance you will not have there ma so advance okati mana own ga mana raskovali okka advance mana raskunam ante the rest all are opposite postings only so mari advance ela raskovali now just remember uh, if you don't know where the advance we have to post it so what i'm going to do is you just see where is umar shankar standing in the consignment he is standing first time on which side debit side isn't it so obviously the second posting he'll come down to what credit credit side he'll come down to the credit side so that's why what we are going to write here from which account i'm taking it a consignment so i'm taking from consignment so consignment first ain't avi expenses సో వాడి ఎక్స్పెన్సెస్ ఎటువైపు ఉంటే అడ్వాన్స్ అటువైపే రావాలి ఎందుకంటే వాడు కదా పే పే చేసేది నానా ఎక్స్పెన్సెస్ సో జస్ట్ ఇఫ్ యూ ఆర్ కన్ఫ్యూజ్ వేర్ వీ హ్యావ్ టు టేక్ అ అడ్వాన్స్ సో వాట్ యూ డూ యూ జస్ట్ సీ వేర్ ది అడ్వాన్ ఎక్స్పెన్సెస్ ఆర్ బీన్ పోస్టెడ్ సో ఇన్ ద ఉమాశంకర్ సా అకౌంట్ ఎక్స్పెన్సెస్ ఆర్ బీన్ పోస్టెడ్ ఆన్ ద క్రెడిట్ సైడ్ సో దట్ మీన్స్ అడ్వాన్స్ ఆల్సో వాట్ వీఆర్ గోయింగ్ టు డూ ఆన్ దిస్ సైడ్ ఓన్లీ వీఆర్ గోయింగ్ టు పోస్ట్ ఇట్ సో వాట్ వీఆర్ గోయింగ్ టు రైట్ బిల్స్ రిసీవబుల్ వీడికి బిల్స్ రిసీవబుల్ అవుతుంది కదా సో బిల్స్ రిసీవబుల్ హౌ మచ్ ఇస్ ది అడ్వాన్స్ ఆన్ ది టాప్ ఐ హ్యావ్ గివెన్ ట్వంటీ ఫైవ్ థౌజండ్ that's it so idokka time tarvata inga meetha vanni my uma shankar malli consignment lo unnadu malli uma shankar consignment lo unnadu so consignment lo what is that commission how much we got 5040 commission we got it anything else is left over nothing else now yeah here on this side again on the credit side he is there so once he is on a credit side next time he'll come down to the opposite that is debit side so from which account i am taking consignment and what is for this sales so how much he sold has sold 72000 now just balance it 72000 minus 25000 minus 70 Yeah, so here what is that? Ma, I remember I always say you could have balance carried on Rayamu because the consigner and a consignee relation is principal and agent. So here what happens? It's not like compulsion that all the time I'll go with a one agent only. No? This time I have gone, I have selected Uma Shankar. Next time I may go for some other person. So that is the reason the balance is not transferred because he is not my employee so eppudu appudu a agent tho manam accounts clear chesukovali andike eppudaina sare you are going to write the balance as bank account only because we are going to we may continue with that same fellow or we may not continue so that's why we'll go with always bank only is this clear so that's it now one more account we are going to have it is 72000 72000 now next one 
one more account will be there nana what is that account is uh, consignment uh, stock and matter goods sent on consignment is there no so that we have to prepare only two accounts kaakunda aako ok account kuda prepare chal actually consignment stock kuda prepare cheyali i'll do that one also so here first is goods sent on consignment account so here first goods sent on consignment again a chapan kadama only one posting you will make rest all just copy and paste opposite postings so goods sent on consignment first time it is on which side debit side of consignment so obviously the second time it will come down to where it will come down to the credit side so emani rastamu from which account i am taking consignment so that's why consignment account and ac we will take as 50000 here now e consignment i have to transfer to the trading account no because i should tell that these whatever goods are there they are not separate they are a much more part of trading account only ani nen chupichali andike compulsory goods sent on consignment we will transfer to the trading account only so here this will be andar prepare avutunara ఎనిథింగ్సైమ్ నౌ So from this FA2, you want a fifth unit. You just give me clarity. Only that one I'll tell. Because uh, I said, na, I don't want uh, too much of things to be done by you people. How much is necessary? Because only three units, if you prepare, it's far than enough. If you want uh, only those people, please join. I'm going to tell. Because unnecessarily, do, I don't want to have any kind of confusions. so you just tell then i'm going to go with it yeah next consignment stock account so consignment stock first time it was on which side ma consignment account lo credit side so obviously first it is credit so next time it will be on the debit side so consignment account how much we got 5 170 so idi matram manam alage carry chestam that is uh, by balance carry down that is 5170 so here it is going to be as to balance brought down 5170 so this is how we are going to do it now this much enough for consigner books now we are going to go with consignee books so consignee books lo emi prepare cheyam nana only except except we are going to prepare consigners account tappa inge emi prepare cheyam because just now i have told for consignee did he get a commission his part of a commission is important ante kani is the transaction is profitable or not for him it doesn't make any difference so that is the reason he will only prepare that consigners account nothing else for him nothing else is important so this is who what is his name uh, narendra dubey that is kanzaini account now this is also again narendra dubey kada again how we have to prepare this account so this i said only one thing you are going to prepare consignment
So first, what you are going to do is Uma Shankar's account. You have prepared Uma. So Uma Shankar's account, all the postings were on a credit side. So here you are going to post it all the things on the debit side. So how many were on this one? Kagapati ikda we are not preparing consignment. Akar consignment and rasam kabe ta anitke consignment rasam. Ikda consignment kaad kada. So that's the reason here. What we'll use, we'll use bank and mata. But the there, first one is what bills receivable is there. So here we are going to write. Madhuri, uh, uh, once again, I'll answer. Let me complete this one. So uh, bills receivable is there. So here we are going to write debit side to bills payable. What we are going to write to bills payable. We are going to write. So how much is the advance? Twenty five thousand. Then what is the next thing? Expenses. Kada. So here we'll write as to bank. Everything is going to be a bank only, ma. So remember that one. Everything is going to be bank only. Then commission. Ki matram we'll write commission. So how much is the commission? Five zero four zero. And uh, what else is there? Balance, no? Okay. So simply, this also you are going to write as to bank balancing figure. No need of uh, calculating also because everything will be the same. Everything ditto it will be. That's why. I'm